Hey guys, welcome back to Gemma Master and in this video, let's check out the super important pattern of paradiddle with a Gemma drum. So what is the paradiddle pattern? Well, as some of you may know, it's one of the most famous and important patterns in drumming. It refers to right, left, right, right, and then the opposite, left, right, left, left. So eight strokes in total, if we're gonna do this pattern, and uh, the para is either a right, left, or a left, right, while the diddle part is the double stroke, either a right, right, or a left, left. So that's where the name comes from, para, Diddle, right, left, right, right, left, right, left, left, para diddle. So a right, left, right, left, right, right would be a para para diddle. See what I mean? Coined by the famous rapper P Diddle. That's not true. Anyway, the para diddle. I'll first show it to you uh, using only slap strokes. They are all the same volume. And I start with my right hand. Now let's add a loud slap in the beginning of the four. And once you've done four strokes, again, loud and three quiet strokes. Now let's put the bass stroke as the first stroke, making it into boom, a straight beat. Now before I show you the same straight beat using a paradiddle, I'm just gonna say that uh, many times this paradiddle version of the straight beat is more cooler to play because of obviously those double strokes. It kind of makes a big enough difference that the uh, something extra is heard, especially if you uh, play the straight beat using the paradiddle on the sides. So I'm gonna do both versions uh, faster. Uh, just in the front normal position for the slap stroke and also you can check it out how it sounds played uh, from the sides
So this has been a short overview of the paradiddle. Very important exercise because of the equality of it. You do the same pattern uh, using your uh, right hand as the beginning and also the left hand does the mirror. So a very balanced exercise plus you get to um, learn the double stroke in between making single strokes. So if you have questions, definitely write them in the comments because I do read that stuff and I reply. Also, if you want to take your skills to the next level, maybe even from a beginner level to an advanced level, check out courses and brand new courses on jibamaster.com.